Ananobi. We know how the other teams that got those players trademarked it, but with that said, the Raptors were able to get draft picks plus young hey. exciting talent like Canadian RJ Barrett and Emmanuel quickly Adi Barnes. He is their future. He's their untouchable. He's who that front office feels great about as their corner Eric and Barnes. Emmanuel quickly out there with Dick, and it's Pirtle in at the five spot. Now here's Ingram. His last outing, we saw him pour in 22. Oh, that's an old-fashioned rim wrap. Just a remote league of them took their time and really figure out exactly where they want to expand to. But the question is, Kevin, are you ready? I am always ready. I know the league is looking even overseas or even maybe south of the border for a possible new entry. But the league has got so much talent on the bottom half of these rosters. I definitely think it's time. And there's a great out. Green with a screen on quickly. Six on the shot clock. Murray, good. Great concentration for DeJounte that time. Just playing. Take a look at the Knicks. They're gaining on some of the teams above them. Trying hard to crack into that top five. Well, right now for New Orleans, they believe they can be more competitive than they've sure. Seeing around the NBA or the next thing that you're anticipating may happen with the way the league will stop. But that may dwindle in the middle of their roster. But we will see a more competitive league because of these new CBA changes. And less of a chance of super teams to just more punch for that. New Orleans leading by three. It's stolen by Barrett. It's tipped. And a fast break now for the Pelicans. New Orleans moving it around. Murray against Barrett. Pass to Robinson Earl. Jumps up. Finishes the break with a slam. Atkins of that play. Yeah, the steal was sharp, but the slam topped it off. And we say it time and time again, so I'll repeat it. Have to be careful with the ball, or this is what happens. And the basket by McCollum. McCollum had for him as much as possible. Now, here's Mitchell. Looking at his numbers, he's averaging about uh, six and a half points a game. And the three ball is good. Both teams finish. Mm -hmm. Trying to send a message with that slam, I think. Shams, you've been around the NBA for a long time now. Which players do you enjoy watching the most? Greatness, especially the guys that are regarded among the greatest of all time, like LeBron James, like Stephen Curry, like Kevin Durant. You have to throw those in there, but this is... Hey, Shams, I know you're connected throughout the NBA into a lot of front offices, but have you ever thought about maybe shifting gears a little bit and working for a team? There is always intrigue into something like that, Kevin, but I've seen how tough the environment can be, and honestly, it is really much more fun to be talking to you on this side of the media world and the media equation of the NBA. But listen, there's always intrigue with the front office. And a lot of well, that's not a shot he's ever going to pass up, and he shouldn't. Despite the miss, no defender anywhere near him. He's got to shoot that one. Yeah, outstanding job there. I mean, we want sports oh, to bring goodness. people together to really galvanize communities, no matter your ethnicity, no matter your gender, anything. And now I really think the world. I think three of the top, what, five, six players, we got Doncic. Uh, you know, we've got Porzingis, of course, who was such a nice player, but Adekumo and Jokic. I mean, the names go on and on of key contributors to win a bucket down low. They've been the aggressors taking the ball inside and attacking at the rim. Now here's Barnes. He's got seven. Quickly the pass to Barrett. Hands it from downtown. Barrett's got sick. And got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. And after years of rumors around OG Ananobi and Pascal Siakam, the Raptors tell them. Well, Kevin, I think all GMs take that into account. A team wants to be confident it'll have a stable roster over the course of a long season. Wasted no time on that one. Two minutes into the second half of play now. Two open that time. Made it with two easy. He's got 15. And it feels like DeJounte Murray's well over this game. And checking out the numbers for England. He's been fantastic over the last 10 games or so. He's around 30 points per clip. Four assists and three rebounds. And it says a lot that when we see numbers like this. Left wing. Six to shoot. 
McCollum deciding where to go with it. Knocks down the three ball. McCollum's got six in the cup defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. And that one's good, Abaji. Yeah, I love the... Buddy Barnes is that infectious enthusiasm. The guy celebrates every big play for him or his teammates. And the shot is good. The Raptor lead has been cut to just... Yeah, a terrific, unselfish play right here. Set up his teammate. And how about the setup this way? What an advantage if your off guard can make plays. Arrive. So good to have you with us. You've got Brandon Ingram. Trey Murphy is out there with Daniel Tice. And there's McCollum. And it's Noel in at the two spot. And for the Pelicans, their shooting has been wild. 76%. That's just unbelievable. A three from McCollum. That's good. And it's Ingram with the assist. Ingram Mano grabs the miss. One made three for him for the game. Does he focus closer in? Let's see. And Mitchell gets it to go. 11 points for Kelly Olenek. Well, Olenek at his size is big enough to get the job done. Ingram outside. Some nice passing here by New Orleans. Shot clock at five. There's a good screen. Here's Hawkins. Buries it from three-point range. Hawkins has got Ingram outside. Over Barnes. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the ring. Now the momentum is huge. Ingram against Barnes. There's the screen. Ingram kicks to Hawkins. And again, New Orleans with the triple. He has a lot of points from long range this half. With the step back. Shoots from 12. Good. He hits the jump shot. Got a piece of it. And Barnes has got the ball here for Toronto. A miss that time. Would have put him up. New Orleans is round 4-7 with the long ball here in the fourth quarter. Barrett against Ingram. To the paint. Here's Hawkins. Good! Oh, the nerves on this guy. <laughs> Thoughts on what Coach wants to do here? Big chance here to tie it with a bucket. Well, they just need a solid play right now, and Coach going through his index cards to find one to get something going. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of... DeJounte Murray is out there with Hawkins. Then it's Ingram, and it's Green. The guy that's that dependent. In the corner, Barrett with it. To the inside. Here's Quickly. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. And the Raptors lead by two. And it's coming easy for them right now. Five baskets in a row in the paint. Outside for Murray. Pass to Hawkins. Back to Murray. Green with a screen on Quickly. Clock is at three. Here's Murray. Oh, and good. That thing was that time as it falls. Murray's got 24 points. Murray not too bad at creating his own offense off the dribble. It's Barrett on the wing. And here is Quickly. Hurdle with a screen on Hawk. And here's Quickly for three. Drills it from outside. Quickly's got five points. In and here's Ingram from the yard. Good on the triple. Ingram's got 32 points. Oh, not only ties it up with the hoop, but puts them in front now with the free throw. That could be the play of the game if they come out on top. Ingram attacking and slammed up by Ingram. Well, Ingram's going to practice. this. Mean that clutch free throws become easy. Inside, Nisi. Money! Murray looking more for the big shot. And when he's rolling like this, watch out. Here's Barnes. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. I like the control from Barnes while getting fouled.
still able to get that shot up. He's able to hit the second one, and that gives them the lead. They come away with the lead, but I'm sure he's kicking himself over that last miss. Murray against quickly to take the lead. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. And Murray just determined to produce on that play. Yeah, big play on the front end to finish this. Now's the time to burn some pop. It comes. Come on, DeJounte Murray coming up. Five, five. So he gets them both, and it's a six-point ball game. Yeah, that'll ice it right there. Not everybody can keep their composure at the line in such a big situation. And here's Barnes for three. Nails the triple. So it's a narrow victory for New Orleans, pulling it out for a double. They escaped with a victory, although they needed an extra period to get it done. Yeah, but what a great game. I mean, both teams, I felt like, gave it their all. But when it came to OT,